Hey guys, it's Aubrey and I'm so excited to show you my new custom Disneyland journal that I created right on our website. They're super easy to make and you can drag and drop images in, you can add text, or you can even design it before and upload your image. We also have our shop journals, which are available on our website, that are already designed for you. You can just add them to your cart and purchase them. I created my journal before we went on our trip so that way I could bring it with us and I designed the cover by just dragging a image of Disneyland into my Persecuti Prince account and dropping it into the software and then I added text right in our software. The first page that I created was a cover page and that has the dates from when we went on our trip and then I created a countdown so that I could count down all the days up until our trip. And then I also made a bucket list and wrote down all the things that I wanted to make sure that we didn't forget to do while we were in Disneyland. And then what I did was I mapped out all the next pages and decided what was going to go where so that way I didn't have to do them in order necessarily. And I chose the dotted pages because I like that it can give you a guideline for where you want to place your images or to be able to make sure that you can you will write straight. And we have a hundred pound paper, which is really nice and thick, but we also have lines and blank pages and that would work great as well. The next page that I created was from our first day in Disneyland. And I added in our tickets, which is fun to be able to look back on. And then I added in pictures and journaling and text and different stickers and embellishments to add to it and to make it look cute. And then for my next page, I did a page on our favorite rides from our first day at Disneyland and just fun memories and pictures from that day and things that we did. And then I did a page on California Adventure and this one I just wanted a little bit more simple so I just added in pictures with a title. And then the next one I did our favorite rides from California Adventure and journaling just about Cars Land and our fun day there. One of my favorite pens is the Tombow Brush Grip Pen. I use that for the titles and for any thicker writing that I wanted to do. And one of the nice things about this pen is that it doesn't bleed onto the next page. And you can also buy a pack, different packs of them. There's different colors. It even comes with a blender pen, which is nice for filling in larger objects. And another one of my favorite pens that I used was the Microline pens. And these are really nice for writing text and journaling and the black comes with different thicknesses so you can use different thicknesses depending on how big you're writing. And then I got these really cute stickers and embellishments from scrapbook.com and they have tons of different Disneyland packs that you can choose from and these were really fun to put on my pages to make them cute and add a little more interest to them. And then for my photos that I used, I used our 4x8 collage, which has 2x2s on them that you cut out later. You just drag and drop your images into them, and then when you cut them out, they are the perfect size for your journal. And then I also used some 3x4s, just because I wanted some bigger pictures. And then I also used the 4x6 collage with the white borders, so that way when I cut them out, they had white borders around them. I'm super excited to finish my journal and I love that I have this to look back on in years to come and show pictures to all my friends and family and to remember our fun trip that we had.